if sin sin alpha is equals to 3 by 5 where pi by 2 is less than alpha is less than pi evaluate cos 3 alpha it is given that sin alpha is equals to 3 by 5 and alpha is between pi by 2 and pi which means it is in the second quadrant the 90 degree between 90 degrees and 180 degrees means alpha is in the second quadrant we know that cos <coughs> 3 theta is equals to 4 cos cube theta minus 3 cos theta. Since cos 3 alpha is in the form of cos 3 theta, we can write it as 4 cos cube alpha minus 3 cos alpha. Now we will find the value of cos alpha. So given that sin alpha is equals to 3 by 5, we know that sin theta is equals to opposite side by hypotenuse, which means uh, 3 is the opposite side and H 5 is the hypotenuse. So if <coughs> alpha can be written as 3 by 5. So, to find the third side, we will use the Pythagoras theorem. So, which is 5 square minus 3 square is equals to 4 square. Therefore, the adjacent side is 4. Now, cos alpha is equals to adjacent side by hypotenuse, which is 4 by 5. But since alpha is in the second quadrant, that will be minus 4 by 5. Substituting the value of cos alpha, which is minus 4 by 5, in the formula of cos 3 alpha, we can write it as 4 into minus 4 by 5 whole cube minus 3 into minus 4 by 5. Now minus 4 whole cube can be written as minus 64 and 5 cube can be written as 125. And this minus 3 into minus 4 will be plus 12 by 5. So 4 into minus 64 by 125 plus 12 by 5. Now 4 into minus 64 is minus 256 plus. Now here in denominator we have 5. To equate the denominators we will multiply and divide it by 25 so that the denominators are equal minus 256 plus 12 into 25 by 125 12 times 25 is 300 so minus 256 plus 300 by 125 300 minus 256 will be 44 by 124 therefore cos 3 alpha is equals to 44 by 125